Good morning. I'm Henry Raven, and I pastor Sierra Foothills Community Church in Oakdale, California. Today is Thursday, May 14th, and it's approximately 10 a.m. And I'd just like to share with you some things, exciting things, really, that happened in our ministry uh, the past year, 2019. And I'm going to summarize also, well, I'll summarize 2019, but I'm going to add a few things that's happened here uh, in 2020 also, the year being in the fifth month of the year. Last year, we baptized six, six people, and uh, that was great for us. That was a really good uh, step. And we had 22 conversions. People made decisions for Christ, 22 people. That was really exciting. We added six new members also, and we have seven transformational ministries where uh, lay people lead those ministries. It's opportunities for people to grow closer to Christ, to grow stronger in their faith and those kinds of things. And that's really, that's really for us a great thing to happen here. Uh, we partner with 14 different ministries in our community, and we are proud to be a part of our community. And uh, we have eight youth here at this time. That's really our weak spot in the ministry, developing our youth program. And we're doing that without the, youth of, the, the use of a youth pastor. Uh, hopefully, at some point in the future, we'll be able to afford a youth pastor and get a really vibrant youth ministry going here at our church. Financially, we reached our goals in 2019. We fulfilled our obligations and we finished in the black. And when I say finished in the black, we were like uh, maybe six, eight hundred dollars uh, over what we really budgeted for. And so that was a good thing for us. God really blessed us in every way. He really has. Even with the weaknesses that we uh, are faced with, we're, we're really working diligently on those things. And we're proud also to have uh, partnered with a Hispanic ministry in our church here. So that's been a blessing also. Uh, we're not um, a burden to that ministry. Uh, they help us out greatly and uh, in more ways than financially. And financially, we're, we're really not a burden to them. It's been a good partnership, in fact. And we look forward to more years with them as they go and as they grow. And so it's been good for our church to do that also. We've had some things happen into our sanctuary here. We've cleaned the carpets, which that was a little overdue. We don't get a chance to do those things oftentimes, and the light fixtures, and we've cleaned the chairs also, and that was a combination project between the Hispanic ministry and our ministry here at Oakdale. So again, God has really blessed us, and it's been just a joy to watch people grow in both, both these congregations and watch people uh, take that out into the community and uh, share Christ, especially at a time like this. 2000, 2020, I said I'd share a little bit. And the thing is that, uh, as you well know, COVID-19 has changed everything. It's been a real game changer for not only the church, but for the world. And so uh, we have been able to navigate that. Uh, we're live streaming on Facebook, and the I, I haven't been a proponent or a fan of Facebook, but now I find myself on Facebook, and I'm really enjoying it. I don't let it absorb my time, but I do take time to look at uh, what I do on Facebook and try to make the adjustments and that sort of thing. But what I do notice and am very happy with is the new contacts that we're making and uh, so people are responding, and hopefully they will continue to respond, and we've made the decision here to continue our Facebook ministry. So that's been a blessing. It's been, uh, I've been out of my comfort zone doing that, that's for certain, but it certainly has been worth it. God has really blessed us in that, that we're able to do it. So uh, again, um, we are so wonderfully 
happy to be able to serve our community here in Oakdale. And we'd like to thank you, the conference, for all the support that you give and all of your prayers. We really appreciate it. So thank you again. God bless you. And I hope this has been helpful.